other words, for some people think that violence is the only reason to solve every problem. If people keep this violence around us, it's not going to get better. Violence has been in this world for centuries now, and for the same causes, to gain the power of authority. Kids in school feel superior to others by calling other kids horrible names and by making fun of them. Men hate women so they can earn their respect back. The point is that violence won't make you a better person. It will make you a monster and nobody like a monster. There are many different kinds of violence. One of them is called bullying. The victim of this violence are mostly kids and teenagers around the ages of 10 to 18 years old. Bullying is when someone says mean things and do mean things to someone in person or in a social network. Most of the time, it happens in a social network because kids think that by making fun of someone in a social network area, they won't get in trouble by an adult. By an adult. This is one of the worst violence in the world because it's between kids and teenagers. Most of the teenagers today have very low self-esteem because of the media. They haven't still found what they want to do with their lives. So by saying mean things to them, it won't help them be successful since they think that what they are saying is true. There are over 3.2 million of students that are victims of bullying each year. Because of this, approximately 160,000 teens skip schools every day to avoid food bullies. Some of these students drop out of school. Over two-thirds of students believe that school responds poorly to bullying, with high percentage of students believing that adult help is infrequent and ineffective. There have been many cases of suicide because of bullying. One of the recent ones was the suicide of Amanda Todd. She committed suicide on October 10, 2012, at her home in Fort Coquitla, British Columbia, Canada. She was 16 years old when she died. On September 7, 2012, she posted a 9-minute video on YouTube entitled, My Story, Struggling, Bullying, Suicide, and Self-Harm, where she, sh where she showed using her flashcards telling her experiences being bullied. The reason she was bullied was because when she was in seventh grade, she used to video chat to meet new people over the internet. People she met would always give her compliments about her looks. A stranger convinced her to bear her breast on camera. He later blackmailed her with threats to expose the top test photo to her friends, unless she gave a show. The photo of her circulated the internet. She moved to different places to start fresh. But the individual would always disguise himself as a student coming to school. She tried to kill herself by drinking bleach and an overdose of drugs. But it didn't work. She failed in her suicide. Students from her school would make fun of her because she failed in her suicide and in her grades. After the entire nightmare, on October 10, 2012, at about 6 p.m., she was found hanged at her home. Like I said before, most of the teenagers have very low self-esteem, and by telling them mean things, they will only become worse. Everybody makes mistakes. Kids today are always in the internet and they meet strangers every day. As a parent, you, you need to pay attention to everything that the kid is doing. If you don't want to have problems like this, don't talk to strangers over the internet. Once it's on the internet, it stays there forever. If you see someone that is being bullied over the internet or at school, contact an adult or confront the person yourself. If we all stand up together against bullying, the world will be a better place. You might think that the one that you are making fun of is a monster because of the stuff he or she has done. But in reality, you are the monster for making them feel worse. Thank you.